Today, we're gonna talk about society's dirty little secret. In fact, there's someone in your home right now contributing to it as I speak. Yep, you guessed it. We are talking about wastewater. But don't worry, we gotta meet someone who's working to clean it up. Oh, and not by using tissue paper. We live in an age of unparalleled technological advancement, but innovation doesn't happen in a vacuum. I'm Won Ho Chung, a comedian who's serious about understanding how our modern world works. Let's find out today as we discover the GE store. If left untreated, wastewater flowing over land and into streams and oceans would cause a catastrophic amount of disease and pollution. That's where treatment plants come in. Still, billions of people aren't connected to treatment facilities, partly because it takes a huge amount of energy to run one. I'm here at the GE Eco Imagination Center in Abu Dhabi talking about this very problem with my brother from another mother, the Jordanian, we look very much alike, Dr. Marwan al Rub. How are you today? Great. What are the challenges that we face in treating sewage water in this part of the world? This part of the world, as you know, is scarce in water. So when we talk about uh, cleaning wastewater, this process is extremely energy intensive. The GE today has a lot of new technologies that can really reduce the amount of energy needed and at the same time maximize the outcome. So how does GE go about achieving that? Today, to do this, you have to go through multiple steps. Okay, step number one is you have to separate uh, solid particles from, from the primary. So what's the step after that? You have to pump a lot of air, oxygen, into this uh, primary. And this is where the new GE technology comes in. It's called Z-Long. It's basically using uh, hollow fibers to inject the oxygen into the mix. So you have significantly better aeration. So you can inject it at a much lesser pressure. This is uh, reducing the amount of energy by four times. So that's a significant energy saver. I understand that in the first step, we separate the solids from the primary, which is also a term we use for wastewater. Right. And the second step, we use GE's technology called Z-Long to inject oxygen into the primary. Is that correct? Absolutely correct, right. yes. And then the step after that uh -huh. is you take this and put it in special tanks. So you have more gas, meaning you have more energy available for you. And that's when you use that gas to produce energy using this machine here. So is this a car engine? Yeah, no. <laughs> this is Jan Bakar gas engine, OG, okay. that takes gas and produces uh, electricity. Its efficiency is extremely high, and this is why it's used in, in our plants. We have talked about this process, but I don't know what it's called, actually. It's called Energy Neutral Wastewater Treatment Technology. Has GE come up with a way to make this shorter? <laughs> All the technology well, that they have. When you use your creativity. So I just have to summarize this whole exercise. Combining all of this, you know, extracting the various technologies from various GE businesses, what we call GE store, you can reduce the amount of energy needed for a plant like this by more than 50%. This is quite efficient. That's exactly what this is all about, is efficiency. Question, have I been your best student so far? You've been very smart. Really? Yeah. Did you hear that, guys? Yes. I'm pretty smart. 